Hello, my darling loves. Welcome to your love reading for... What did I just do here? Welcome to your love reading for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. So, my loves, I hope everybody is safe, happy, healthy, and doing well. Um, hope everyone had a good holiday. So, let's go ahead and get shuffled up here, guys. Um, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. I do choose winners every single week for free readings. I give away tarot cards, oracle cards, Palo Santo, sage, jewelry, runes, Christmas crystals, books, Bibles. It is a lot of fun. Wow, I caught that with my legs. That was so awesome. I was like, <laughs> um, let's see here. So yeah, don't forget to, I don't know how this got in there. I've got people over for the holidays. I got stuff everywhere. Okay. So, um, what was I going to say? So yes, don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe. Okay. Um, email me with what you would like to manifest for the giveaway at manifest. Uh, no, what is it for? Cancer Baby Tarot at Gmail. If you would like to book a reading, um, it's Cancer Baby Info. Cancer Baby Info at Gmail. Okay. All right. So let's get shuffled up. Holy Spirit, Angel Spirits and Guides, Clarity, Guidance, and Love Messages. Clarity, Guidance, and Love Messages for my Cancers, please. Clarity, Guidance, and Love Messages for my Cancers, please. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus Signs. Clarity, Guidance, Love Messages for my Cancers, please. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus Signs. Holy Spirit, Angel Spirits and Guides, what love messages do my Cancers need to hear today, please? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus Signs. Okay, so we have the Five of Wands. Strife. We got some problems here, Cancer, and the Eight of Wands. Oh, I see a huge fight breaking out here. Um... Maybe we have some jealousy happening here. Someone's angry. Someone's really angry, Cancer. We have the Strength card, Leo Energy. And we have the Queen of Swords, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra Energy. We have the Ace of Cups. And we have the Page of Swords, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra Energy. Ooh, Cancer. I'm seeing a huge fight breaking out here. And I'm seeing somebody getting cut off with his head. Off with their head. <laughs> That's what I'm hearing. Off with their head. Yeah, someone is getting cut off here. And I feel like someone is coming to the realization that they want something new. Okay, that they want something new. So this may be someone looking online, hopping on a dating site, moving towards new love. I feel like someone is straight up saying, done, I want to move on to something new. Someone here is really, it's a, it may be painful, but I don't care. I want something new. I don't want to do this anymore. Off with their head. So we have the lover's card here, Gemini energy. And we have the nine of wands. Yeah, someone's getting sick and tired of being treated as an option. Someone's getting sick and tired of being treated as an option. Someone's getting sick and tired of somebody not making a decision. Someone feeling like they're not being chosen. We've got the Nine of Cups here. And we have the Page of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Energy. Someone may be coming in with an apology saying what you want to hear. We've got temperance, Sagittarian energy. Ooh, they're coming back to apologize, Cancer. And the full Aries energy. Someone here is apologizing for being foolish, for not thinking before speaking, for being noncommittal. Someone here wants to apologize. Someone here is about to come in to offer you everything, all your wish fulfillment, whatever you want, I'll give it to you, just forgive me. The world. And the Seven of Wands. Someone here has been procrastinating, not wanting to change, but I feel like it's a cycle that's ending in this person's life. The Knight of Swords and the Page of Cups. They're rushing in for an apology, Cancer. This person is not, they're chasing you. 
This person I don't think is going to let you go. The Four of Swords. And the Three of Pentacles. This person just wants to make peace with you, Cancer. Yeah, you, you have cut this person off. You, I mean, you are literally looking for someone new. <laughs> like, you are, like, so done. You are so done with this. Um, yeah, you're like, let me just show you how replaceable you are. And I feel like they're rushing in wanting to fix this cancer. They are, yeah. We've got the Eight of Cups here. And the Four of Pentacles. I feel like you're holding back. You're walking away from this person. And I mean really energetically cutting the tie. Okay, really cutting it off, Cancer. Big time. Um, Queen of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Energy. The Ace of Wands. The Eight of Pentacles. And the King of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Energy. We may have an Earth sign here, guys, coming in. Wanting to work with you, Cancer. Someone here is willing to compromise. Someone is willing to compromise because you're you're walking. You're there. You're wow. Like you're ready. To, you're done. Oh my gosh, Cancer, you are so done with this person and their bullcrap. Like you are done, done. Like yeah, you see, Six of Pentacles. They 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 have to come back to balance this out because you're done. Hmm. You're, I, I can't even exp put into words how done you are. Like, you're actually looking for new people. You are dating new people. You've had enough. You are tired of being treated like an option. You're tired of someone's indecision. You're just sick of it. They're coming back to give you your heart's desire, Cancer. Okay? They're going to take that leap of faith. They're going to come in wanting forgiveness. You know... Whatever they have been avoiding from happening, whether it was falling in love with you or committing, whatever they've been, you know, let's just say you wanted something and they've been procrastinating, not wanting to give it to you. They're coming in to give it to you. They're coming. All they want to do is heal this with you, Cancer. That's it. They just want to be on the couch, you know, watching a movie, some apple pie or whatever. They just want to be chilling with you. Um, but it's only going to be because you seriously are walking away from this person. So let me make myself clear, Cancer. If you're arguing with your person and it's just a minor argument and you're not, you haven't really, this is for my Cancers that right now are watching this like, girl, you are crazy. I am not taking that person back. I am, that's who I'm reading for, okay? You know what I'm saying? If you are watching this and you are like, this is a waste of your time, Gina, because it is n hell to the nay nay, I am not going to even I'm not touching this person I'm not going near them I don't even want to say their name I don't even want to think about them that's the energy you need to be in for this reading to resonate with you because this is someone who is sick tired done had enough already looking already on match.com <laughs> if you are already on eHarmony or match or whatever it is plenty of fish you know if you are already talking to other people this is for you because it's only going to be when you really really get fed up with this person that they come in ready to like okay I've made my decision now <laughs> you know what I'm saying that's when that's when they really decide to get it together tell me about this five of wands the knight of swords eight of wands and the queen of swords oh this is a nasty fight this is and some ugly things are getting said here cancer uh, someone, so I don't, it could be you, it could be them. I don't know, but someone here is very quick with their mouth and I feel like it's due to third party energies. The strength card and the ace of pentacles, the queen of swords again, and the hanged man, Piscean energy. Yep. Someone here is cutting this off saying, listen, I've given this enough time. I realize now that you are not worth my time and I'm out. Queen of swords cutting this off. Ace of cups and the wheel of fortune. Page of Swords and Temperance, Sagittarian Energy. Someone here is realizing that they want peace in their life and that new love sounds good to me. <laughs> new love, anything that isn't you is the jackpot. That's it. Someone's like, I don't want to see you, feel you, touch you. I don't want to be near you. I just want to get the hell away from you and be in peace. That's it. The Lover's Card and the Fool, Aries Energy. 
Nine of Wands and the Tower. Aries Scorpionic Energy. Someone here is done. I'm done being played for a fool. I'm done being talked to like a fool. I'm done being treated like a fool. You know, I'm, I'm, you know, why do only fools fall in love? You know what I'm saying? I'm actually listening to that song in my head right now. Um, someone is like, I am done. You're done playing me for a fool. You're just done. The Nine of Cups and the Seven of Cups, the Page of Pentacles and the Six of Pentacles. So someone here comes in offering an apology, wanting to balance out the scales offering dreams come true. The Seven of Cups isn't just option, guys. The Seven of Cups is also dreams, okay? It's also dreams. And with that Nine of Cups, wish fulfillment, dreams coming true, someone here is offering to balance out those scales. Temperance and the Two of Pentacles, the Fool, and the Queen of Cups. So someone here wants forgiveness for juggling or for being undecided. Somebody here, um, Cancer, wants you to take that leap of faith. It wants you to trust them again, Cancer, because there you are, Cancerian energy. I'm sorry, my nail looks so horrible. I have to go get my nails done. Five of Cups and the World, Seven of Wands and the Ace of Cups. So what's happening here now is you're moving on to new love with this ace of cups you're you're dating new people you're but this person wants to avoid that okay this this knight of swords energy here wants to stop that from happening they have real regret for not stopping their crap when they had the opportunity okay they should have stopped their shit when they had the opportunity you see what i'm saying and now they're trying to stop you and block you from moving on to new love knight of swords and the knight of wands the page of cups and the four of cups i feel like this person is pursuing you relentlessly, Cancer, okay? But whatever they're saying, it's not being reciprocated. That Four of Cups energy, they're offering you something, but you don't really want to take it. Four of Swords and the Eight of Pentacles. Three of Pentacles and the Empress. Yeah, you see, this person wants to recover this. Cancer, they're willing to put the work in. You know, they're willing to put you on a pedestal, treat you as Empress. They want that new beginning. They want to do this, but... Nine of Wands and the Eight of Cups. See the Nine of Wands up there? You're tired and you're done and you're walking away. Four of Pentacles and the Six of Swords. Leaving the bullshit behind and moving to more peaceful waters. I am done. You know what I'm saying? I am done. Ace of Wands and the Five of Pentacles. Now this person is left out in the cold with regret, realizing that they should have gotten it together while you were giving them the chance. The Queen of Pentacles and the Eight of Wands. So your person is in Queen of Pentacles mode. The Queen of Pentacles is very kind, caring, nurturing, solid, stable, responsible. And they're coming forward, Cancer, saying, listen, I would rather settle down and do the right thing than lose you. Okay, they're chasing you. Eight of Pentacles and the Sun. I will do everything I can and work to do everything I can to make you happy. King of Cups and the Nine of Swords. They're stressing you the hell out, Cancer. They are stressing you out because you want to know something. You've been in this energy of the Eight of Swords for a long time now, knowing that something is happening behind your back, knowing that something isn't right. And I don't know if maybe a truth came out possibly, but something happened here where you know that something isn't right. Do you see what I'm saying? Something must have come out that, you know, because with the Five of Wands and the Eight of Wands, I'm feeling... <laughs> a really nasty fight. And usually that's that's usually jealousy. It's usually a passionate fight. So you may have found out that this person was doing dumb stuff, you know, behind your back. <sighs> Cancer. I feel like you're pretty stressed out having to make this decision because I can tell that you love this person. I can also tell that you're really done like really done intuition and manifestation and ascended masters so cancer you're either praying or manifesting you're like an empress mode here okay i do feel though that whatever's happening is very much divinely guided the vast universe and transformation and remember we had the world card here again there's cycles ending here there's a major ending happening here and someone is changing big time okay um i, I you know indecision magician in the mirror and financial constraints this person was indecisive this person was trying to be manipulative and this person lost okay they lost cancer um and they're seeing that now they're seeing that now 
Getting to know each other as you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens and trust the situation is calling for you to have faith. So you're trying to trust this person, but at the same time, do you see how there's three people in that card? Okay, so you're trying, you have your angels here trying to bring you two together. You're trying to put your best foot forward and trust this person, but there's still other people in the picture. Okay, romantic feelings, your feelings are real and worth exploring and children, your love life is being affected by children. So there may be love here. This person may, there may have an age difference because they're coming in as a knight of swords and you're coming in as a queen of cups. Okay, um, actually the queen and king of cups is here, true pair. But anyway, so this person may just be more emotionally immature or they may be younger or this person wants a new beginning with you because they realize that they love you. But this person was very indecisive. This person may have had to choose between you and someone else and they were being very manipulative you know what i'm saying they were saying whatever they had to say just to play everyone like puppets and you're done they're realizing here that they're losing you they have lost you i feel like for many of you you're gone you've already started dating new people but they're coming back to offer you everything cancer okay they're coming back to offer you everything now, it's either you here that is really stressed out or it's them that's really stressed out trying to get you back. I feel that this person is presented more as the Knight of Swords energy. So let's see. Let's take it into the extended and let's see what this Knight of Swords is up to. True feelings and intentions. What will happen if you reconcile? Are they going to be loyal? Are they going to be committed? And we'll pull some Oracle. Okay. I love you guys. The link for the extended is below. Bye, guys.